Good morning everybody, it's the long weekend and that is exciting and today we are going to be doing something cool. I'm going to go sleep at my parents' house in their backyard, I'm gonna go camp. Um, my sister has a compromised immune system, so I'm not allowed in the house, but we are going to make the best of the long weekend with all the campgrounds being closed and camp in their backyard. So that should be fun. First time um, doing that and I'm really excited to like, get out and use all my camping stuff. So I'm going to take you along for that. Right now it's 1030, so I just showered and washed my hair, did my makeup, and one of my friends is working nearby in a field. He's disking it, I think. So he asked if I could bring him a coffee and a sandwich so I'm gonna go down to um, the store and grab him that just so he has something to eat because farmer life um, you never know like when you'll be able to stop and get food especially when you're out in the boonies so yeah that's what we're doing right now first so just doing that to be uh, nice and yeah we'll take you along and then we're gonna get all ready for camping okay so we got an extra large coffee a sandwich and a two liter bottle of coke you know just all the essentials while I was driving, when I turned off my driveway, something flew up out of my car and I was like, what was that? And I forgot that I'd put the mail on the hood of my car last night and it flew off on the side of the road. So now we're gonna have to hunt for that. So that's a good day. Found it. Okay, here is the start of the camping stuff I'm bringing. This is a um, outdoor blanket that's my cousin's that I'm gonna use. Um, this is my tent. It is a six per four person tent. Um, I actually like this tent. It was pretty cheap and I've got a lot of use out of it. It's kind of small. I would I want to upgrade to a bigger one, but for now it works. This is my cousin's thermo rest. I'm gonna be using. A sleeping bag. I love the sleeping bag because it's not that shiny, like, scratchy material. It's, like, actually, like, uh, comforter material. So I love that. Um, this is my chair. This is the cooler I'm going to be bringing. I do have a giant cooler, but I don't need that just for tonight. So I have a bottle of wine in there that my mom um, wanted me to bring. And I'll show you when I fill the rest of it up. And here's my camping box. I have a video that I'll link below on my essential... Um, camping box and it's got so many goodies in here so watch that if you want and I reorganized it um, a few months ago so yeah and that is it for now and then I'll show you when I have more things okay so this is the some of the clothes that I'm bringing I bring this suitcase because I like having a suitcase in the tent because you can open it and you can see everything rather than trying to like rifle through a duffel bag so the clothes I'm bringing are these warm socks. I like to sleep in these. Um, a pair of mitts and a toque, again, for sleeping around the bonfire. I have a pair of fleece pants to put over leggings. I sleep with leggings and then fleece pants. And then also a hoodie. Um, I have shorts for tomorrow. These are my Levi's um, in case it gets warm enough to wear shorts. I have this tank top. I think I'm going to wear this tank top today. Um, and then I have a plaid shirt and this scarf. This could be used for many different things, like obviously as a scarf, or you could use it like to like as an extra kind of like blanket or um, pillow or just something to like snuggle at night. And then I have this plaid fleece coat that I love, and I'm gonna be wearing that um, underneath my actual coat. And then I have some toiletries in here, and I'll show you what I bring. I have sunscreen and face screen face screen because I have really sensitive skin so I need like separate face sunscreen I have um, these shampoo samples uh, I just keep these in here because these came in super handy one time when my cousin and I went camping and we ended up um, having to have a shower so I was like oh my gosh I do have shampoo so I always keep some shampoo in here I have this um, cleansing cloth I've had this for so long I haven't used it yet these are the best. These are the Olay face wipes and they, they you have to add water to them so they're actually dry which is so much better for traveling because you don't have to bring the whole pack with you and they are like way easier to pack I find. Um, I have some dry shampoo. I have like styling cream. This is because my hair is really curly so if it get, does get wet then I have something to help tame it. Um, I have a cleanser and my face moisturizer as well as some body lotion. Um, and these hair elastics and bobby pins and then a little perfume and in here I have Advil, Tums and um, Gravol just to cover all the basics and that is all in my toiletries 
And I'll just show you what I'm wearing. This black coat is awesome. I got it from Marksburg Warehouse on sale and I like have been living in it. I love this thing. And then underneath I just have this zip up hoodie from Mar uh, Giant Tiger. It was in the men's section but I love it. And then underneath I'm probably going to put a t-shirt on. But I have this um, like bra thing. But I have this like lounge bralette from airy and I love this thing I sleep in it like you, you don't even you can't even tell that you're wearing it and I'm obsessed I want more colors um, as well as these leggings that are from airy they are the 7 8 length but I got them in short and they're very short I didn't really need to but they're super super comfy and they are like the perfect high waist so these are probably gonna stay on my body for like, I'll sleep in these and wear them and then wear them again tomorrow. And I'm going to be putting on running shoes as well as bringing sandals. Okay, hello everybody. So it's actually like two weeks later and I didn't end up going camping that night because it rained and then I got like the stomach flu or something. So I'm going to go now. So a few things have changed. It is now like plus 30 outside. It's so hot, so my clothing will, is going to have changed from the last time I showed you what I packed because right now I'm in a crop top and shorts instead of like bringing a toque and mitts and it's going to be hot, but we're going to have so much fun anyways and I'm super excited to go. So, so far I've just um, started to pack up a little bit trying to decide what food to bring and I will show you when we start packing. Okay, so I just have this farm boy basket. Um, and first of all, I have my hat. I love this hat. Um, then in here, I have some grapes that I'm going to be bringing. And in here, I have all of Ruger's dog food. I got this cool little thing from um, the dollar store. And I have a portable bowl in there and a bone for him. Um, in here, I'm going to put this in my cooler. But this is just iced coffee. So I'm going to bring that for the morning. Then I have my Yeti cup to drink out of tonight and maybe some coffee in the morning. I have a, this packet of oats, uh, maple and brown sugar oats that I'm just going to add water to in the morning. Um, and then these are clippers. My dad wants to cut his hair, so I brought that for him. I brought this koozie because I don't like holding cold drinks. And then I bought, brought a, water, ugh, a wine opener and I'm going to be putting both these in my camping bin. Um, I brought a premier protein shake just to have. I brought two protein bars just to have. And then these are bringing for my parents because I got them for them. And so that's all the food I have so far for dinner and everything. I think my dad and I will eat together. So probably just whatever he has. But that is some snacks that I brought. Okay, so I got the car all loaded up. We're about to leave. It's so hot out. But I just wanted to show you what I was bringing for entertainment. So I brought my iPad and I downloaded some movies on Netflix for me to watch tonight. I also have my Kobo, my e-reader. I brought a speaker and then I could listen to podcasts or something on my phone if I want to. But I am naturally like pretty scared sleeping at home and I've never slept in a tent by myself before. So this could be interesting. Wow, it's hard to breathe. It's so hot. So yeah, this could be interesting. Um, and hopefully I make it through the night without like having a panic attack. <laughs> Hey, hi guys. So we are in the tent, me and Rooks, and we are just getting settled into bed. I brought my iPad, so I'm gonna watch a movie, I think. Um, and we had some wine tonight, and we talked a lot, and then, um, I don't know, we'll get up to tomorrow. It was so hot today, and tomorrow, um, I mean, tonight is not as hot as it was, so I was really scared for a bit about the heat, but it's not as hot as I thought it was going to be, and Rugs looks super comfy down here on the bed. Um, yeah, so first time sleeping in a tent alone, so we'll see how it goes, but I'm excited, and 
good to be independent. Good morning, so we made it. It's currently 7, Ruger was up at 5, and I just had some coffee with my dad before he went to work, but um, this thermo rest thing was not that comfortable, so I'm not sure if that's just how it's supposed to be or if I didn't do it right, but anyways, we made it through the night. You can hear the dam here, so that was like really soothing, and yeah, it just, because it gets light out, then Ruger was like super awake, so... Yeah, right now I'm watching my iPad outside and he's playing.